Hi guys, Steve Weber here. Uh, in tonight's episode, I'm going to be showing you a cool 3D printed lampshade that I made uh, that you can make too, so uh, stay tuned. sure everybody's seen by now the Victorian hurricane lamp on Thingiverse uh, with its little uh, lampshade that you print uh, you know using vase mode on your printer uh, with a single just a single perimeter all the way around round and around and around uh, so I took that idea and I chopped it up in Tinkercad and I added some little uh, little nubs here so that it'll snap on top of the, um, you know, the metal part of a regular lamp. So this is going to go right there and just snap into place so it holds it in place. And I'm going to turn it on and check out that. I'm using this with a LED light bulb um, so you can see it's fairly cool to the touch uh, the bottom base of the LED light bulb gets a little bit warm but the bulb itself is relatively cool so there's no danger of uh, melting this thing I would not suggest uh, using a regular incandescent lamp with it uh, because of the heat in fact I probably wouldn't even use a uh, compact fluorescent just because it the lamp is so close to the bulb um, but it's really nice to have this little lamp here in my work area here's an earlier version that I had tried uh, where I just took part of the design and mirrored it on top trying to create something that would sort of rest on there but it because it's not a symmetrical shape it there was no really good way for it to sit on there but the green looks cool it's a green uh, PETG uh, it casts a green light throughout the room it's uh, kind of a neat mood light so this lamp looks really good and uh, didn't cost me hardly anything I think I paid about five dollars for the uh, lamp itself at Goodwill uh, it didn't come with a shade and uh, uh, and then I printed this lampshade with you know a single perimeter of filament, so it barely used just a few grams, and doesn't take long at all to print one of these, and it looks great. Um, the other really neat thing about this lamp, uh, this lampshade, is uh, you don't need a, a big printer in order to print it. Um, it's so tiny, you know, just about anybody, uh, with just about any printer uh, can do this. So uh, I encourage you to go to your local thrift shop and find a, a nice small little lamp. Uh, this one I picked up is actually like a cast iron or uh, some kind of really solid metal uh, painted white. Um, I thought it was pretty neat and uh, cleans up nice so get yourself a nice um, you know foundation to work with just get yourself uh, find yourself a, a little uh, lamp at a thrift shop like this and uh, print this out and put it on there you're good to go since I was using an LED bulb in here anyway, the next logical thought uh, to me was why not throw an RGB LED bulb in here? Uh, and so that's exactly what I've done. Uh, so now, right now I've got it cycling through the different colors, but I can set it to a specific color or, you know, whatever. I want to thank you for tuning in to the show today, and uh, I encourage you, if you enjoyed what you saw, give me a subscribe, give me a thumbs up. Uh, and don't forget to follow me on social media. Uh, don't forget to check out my other videos. And uh, keep printing, keep making, and uh, keep rocking on.